Thank you for joining me, Coach Greg here. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna focus on our legs. We're gonna actually just do one exercise, which we're going to do, it's a squat. And if you can do a squat, sitting down and standing up, sitting down, standing up, um, that will develop your legs, that'll develop your, your glutes, your butt, and it's an overall one of the best exercises and lunges but this doing squats is one of the best exercises you can do for your legs and your butt. All right, I'll show you what I mean and we'll go ahead and do it. And if you've got a chair next to you, if you're at home, grab a chair because what I have here is you'll see here at the park is these, these walls or these seats and I'll be using these to, to do the squats on to show you how to do it with a, with a chair. Here, let me get the camera set up. All right, let's see if we've got that set up. Okay, cool. All right, so what we're gonna do is you wanna separate your feet a little bit. Don't have them too narrow, but separate them so that they're wider than your shoulders. And then what you're gonna do is that you're gonna put your hands in front of you a little bit to create a balance forward. Okay, it's not to do this, but it's just to keep your back straight and then stand straight up. Like that. <laughs> okay, so we come down and then stand straight up. Come down and stand straight up. And up. Three, four. Keeping your back straight, not forward. Five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and stand straight up. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20. Okay, we're gonna hold off there. I'll come back to the camera doing ours. And what I wanna encourage you to do is we did 20. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do another uh, three sets of 20 and that'll be a, uh, a decent workout for your legs. And if you can do 10, if you can do five, how many ever you can do. And it might be a good idea if you're having a problem with your balance. Number one is to make sure your feet are wider than your shoulders planted on the ground and you have a stable ground surface to put your feet on. And if you need to have a table next to you or something to hold on next to you while you're going up and down until you can get your balance back on target, that would be great. That's not a problem. That's actually, I would encourage that if you're having a problem with your balance. All right, guys, give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe. You guys have a beautiful day. Until next time, bye.